You're joining me as I head to meet Tobias, first time on the channel, former work colleague, designer, academic and most relevant for today I suppose, very fit and fast cyclist. Today we're going to do the classic Kent loop down to Bedlstead Lane which is about 45k but with a decent amount of climbing and I think Tobias has some plans to go hard up some of these climbs. He's doing some climbing challenge with his cycling club. I'm hoping he's psychologically prepared to do a lot of waiting at the top of climbs because I'm not in the best state today. Went to the pub last night, had quite a few pints, had quite a late night. I also played badminton this week for the first time since Covid and I was absolutely wrecked. Badminton really shouldn't be an excuse for being tired for cycling but I'm gonna use it as one today. But anyway, I'm waiting to meet Tobias, 45k loop, he's fast, I'm slow at the best times and in a bad state probably expect to see a lot of me riding alone him in the distance and me puffing at the top of hills cheers i've been to the sound a bit posh doesn't it i'm shit if that makes it any better also it's really windy today so hopefully the little fluffy things on the camera are doing their jobs Even when there's clearly tons of room to get through those, I still absolutely shit it. I bet you in there, Bowington's considered a rough sport. It's Dulwich College, by the way. Yeah, come on, buddy. Tobias, can you consider this a model release form? I do consider this model release form, give my consent. There's no going back now. Dr. Tobias Ravel? Not yet. Not yet. Nearly. Yeah, it depends if my supervisor sees this or not. I would reckon the odds of your supervisor being one of the 141 subscribers is pretty slim. You never know. Maybe I'm the Kim Kardashian of your YouTube career. Where are we going today? We are going to do a little Kent loop up through Crystal Palace, West Wickham. Then we're going to do Bedlstead, which is a really nice climb, but it's part of a competition I'm in at the moment. <laughs> And then we'll loop back down Cudham Lane and back into London in time for tea and chips. I reckon expect to see lots of Tobias's arse today. <laughs> Distant arse. Last time I rode, rode with you, Tobias, I was wearing a football top and football shorts and had flat pedals. Now I look more, almost as stupid as you do. I'll still be just as slow as last time, so... Look, it counts though, right? I think so, as long as you look fast. Yeah, no one knows you are. The ride hasn't even started and he's already gone. I've already run out of gears. To pop in for a Toby. Lots of that for you today. It's great to ride with someone who shakes their head at drivers as much as I do. Can I ask you what your favourite chain restaurant is? Man, that's a good question. Is it really chain though? I like the Temple of Satan. That's just at the moment. My rule for chain is needs to exist outside of London. Ooh. Rex. That's all I know of. Oh no, oh, well, the Brewdog have problematic employment practices. Good food. Saying Brewdog is your favourite chain restaurant is the kind of thing I'd usually edit out the video to not make you look like a twat, but I might leave it in. You boxed me into a corner. I said Greg's, then thought that's a bit small ball. I upped it to Brewdog, remembered their poor employment practices. I think he might have overthought that uh, favourite chain restaurant question. I'm going to go down this hill and up the other side really as fast as I can. And I'll see you at the bottom or top in a pile of sick, okay? Enjoy. It's going to fly down and then fly up Bedlstead. I'm going to go incredibly slowly. I reckon it could be four or five minutes he's got to wait at the top. Let's see. Hard at the very bottom. taking this climb so serious that he started climbing it, got disrupted by a car, and he's gone back down to take it on a fresh. So I won't be keeping up with that. Tobias. 
Tobias was actually the first person to ever show me this route. Like I said, when I first rode with him, I was still wearing like football shirt, football shorts. So I was really just starting to get into cycling. So he brought me out here and it was just amazing how quickly from London you can get into like proper countryside and you see like birds of prey, nice views. So I've got a lot to thank Tobias for really. He taught me things like hand signals. I do appreciate him giving me tips and advice back in the day. So cheers Tobias. Hopefully you smashed it up this hill. I'd imagine you're already there. Dread to think how many minutes you've been sat here. <laughs> Not that Four? Long. Five? Yeah, about five minutes. <laughs> how does that feel? It was it, it was horrible. Explain what you're actually doing. I'm doing the London Velo Cycle Club Six Hills Challenge. Might you win? No, I won't win. I'd like to get a new personal record and maybe get get top 20. Couldn't even be a leader. <laughs> Physically couldn't. <laughs> He's dropped in! Oh, no, he hasn't. He's fucked. He's fucked. The one thing I've got on my side is I'm the one in charge of the edit. So, as we were colleagues for six years before you abandoned us and me. Colleagues and friends. Yeah, I mean, we weren't friends to start with. I think we saw each other slightly as enemies. I don't, I don't know what I thought about you. That was just me. That's quite a learning curve for me. <laughs> <laughs> I just remember being particularly annoying to you for a while and I thought he probably thinks I'm a prick. But that's just how I bond with people. <laughs> Car back. Yeah, so you, you were saying you hated me at work. I was saying I thought you hated me. I don't hate anybody, man. It's not Star Wars. That lit sign said, what would your mum say? And it kind of doubles as a critique of your horrendous climbing attempts. It's a good answer, though. Nice easy ride for you. Pretty damn hard and fast ride for me. It was physically okay, but I was just mentally excruciating, worrying about the impression I'd made by my choice of change. <laughs> Based on your rules, I'd say great. They really put me in a corner. I think you put yourself in the corner, mate. I feel like I Ed Miliband did the question. Heck yes, I love Brew Dog. Well, thanks for riding with me. That was a very pleasant way thank to spend a Thursday you. afternoon. Thank you for riding with me. It was a joy. And let's just see if your Kim Kardashian prediction comes true and the, the numbers rock it. He goes. Great to see Tobias. Easy ride for him. Pretty hard ride for me. Pretty fast for me. I'm pretty knackered now, to be honest. Thanks also for watching. If you like this video, if you could hit the like button. Apparently, it's good for YouTube. I don't know. I'm gonna go home and eat all of the food. Cheers. <laughs>